have got people within the UK, uh, both down south, uh, within the uh, North London Luton area, with a little 5 watt, less than 20 pound radio. Just to show you that you can reach out and cross the world. Now what you need to remember is time zones. Now, here at the moment, it's just coming up to midday in the UK. It's 5 to 12. Now, if you want to talk to a people in America, for instance, you need to remember that they're on a different time zone behind us. Uh, the East Coast is 5 hours behind us, and the West Coast is 8 hours behind us. So, at the moment, instead of being 5 to 12, like it is here, on the East Coast of America, it's 5 to 7. That's in the morning. Now, at five to seven in the morning, a lot of people are getting getting out of bed, getting the kids ready for school, driving to work, or they're already at work. So there's not a lot of people on. The best time to catch people in America is on an evening, say 11 and 12 o'clock at night, when they've got the kids back from school and they've finished work or whatever. Same with places like Australia and New Zealand, there's about 11 or a 12 hour difference between us. So, midday here is midnight there. So they're possibly in bed, or they've finished on the radio, you know, they're just chilling, watching a bit of TV, having that last drink before they go to bed, which means that they're not going to be on the radio, or there's going to be very few of them on the radio. Now places like Spain and Europe and things like that, there's a time difference of what, perhaps an hour, maybe two hours, depending on whereabouts in Europe they are. So you've got a good chance of getting these people through the gateway. So you need to take all this information into account before you try and get contacts in foreign countries.